Hello and welcome to another random review and how to. Today we're looking at the Comfort Zone ceramic heater. Picked this up for 25 bucks. I have a link down below if you'd like to purchase it. Uh, this has a picture of a baby on it and that is exactly what we're using this for. Our baby's room uh, gets pretty cold upstairs. It's the second floor. So we have a little heater here. Uh, it's a small heater. It's only 1500 watts. It's 5120 B2U. It's designed for a small room. This will heat up a room. Um, so we had one like this, uh, but it was old and it actually fried out and almost caught on fire. So uh, make sure when you're buying something, you're, you're getting the quality you want. This is a ceramic heater. So it has two heat settings and it has an adjustable thermostat and it's fan forced air. Um, so it actually blows the air out, which is nice. Sometimes you might get one that just radiates the heat up, but for something you want to be able to move around the room, not only for the heater, but for the baby, you may not want to put it too close. These are perfect for babies and baby rooms. Uh, we're trying to transition the little guy over into his crib. So getting a heater that will disperse the air there. Uh, so we're opening it up, it has your little manual. It's pretty cut and dry, so it's not anything crazy that you're gonna need to know about. Go ahead and take that out of the box. It's already put together. There's nothing we have to do. Um, but you can see inside here, there's your coil system. This is where everything's gonna come out of on the top there. You have a thermostat that goes to max. Uh, what we like to do is find the setting we like and we always put a little mark so that anyone that comes over knows exactly where that mark should be. You got your fan, low and high. The cord here, there's your intake in the back. You're gonna wanna make sure you check that too because you have a room that tends to get dusty or uh, if you have pets, you get hair and stuff back there. So you wanna make sure you keep that back clean. Our cord here uh, is about, I want to say, nearly six feet long. So we got our six foot cord. I'm gonna go ahead and plug this guy in. So we are plugged in. I'm gonna show you here on top. It's just your fan setting. Okay, unplugged. Not unplugged, which shows you another feature. So this thing has to be flat to be turned on. See it's on there. It's a little loud, but it could be the surface I'm on there too. Uh, you put it on carpet, it's gonna quiet that down a little bit. So that's our low heating, or our fan, now we're on low. I actually grabbed a little thermometer here, it's a cooking one, but I'm gonna lay it out there. It is the temperature of the house. So I'm just gonna lay this here and show you um, how quick this heats up. Right away, I already got some heat blown out of this, and that's on low on the max setting. I'm gonna go ahead and turn that on high. And I'm gonna let this warm up for a second. We're gonna see what the temperature goes up. Right now we're at 71, but you can see we're already climbing there. We're going above 80, we're at 90, we're now at 100, 110, 120. The baby's crying. He loves his fan already. So you can see right away this thing's blowing out heat. It's immediately gonna start heating up the room. So good little heater, like I said, it's for a baby's room. Uh, it's for other things, but a baby's room is gonna be ideal. You wanna pick one of these up, it's down below. If you like this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next time.